Greetings, Capricorn. We can ready to do the Earth sign YouTube. Greetings. Let's see what's coming in for the Capricorns. Take what resonates. This is for your rising sun, moon, Venus, your customers, cross watches. Y'all know the drill. Take what resonates. Leave the rest on our rock and mind your business. All right, let's see what's coming in here for the Capricorn. Somebody is in their mental space, baby. Somebody is in prison or getting locked up or somebody's in a spiritual or a uh, mental up in their head like Fred and Frida can't get out, self-sabotaging, constantly thinking round and around, obsessively going. If they're going to take a cup of love that the universe is giving to them, somebody's waiting, contemplating. Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, could be a boss, could be a decision about a job. Uh, again, it could be y'all emperor trying to come in. Yep, a lot of kung fu fighting, a lot of chaos, a lot of betrayal, a lot of leveling up, a lot of somebody challenging y'all. Argumentative. So be, it could be a fight at work. So y'all be careful out there. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, somebody, yep, Jupiter, Sagittarius, some abundance coming in. Somebody's fighting over their destiny and fate and their abundance, trying to turn things around, trying to block y'all from moving on because y'all got a good destiny and fate. Gemini, Libra, Prayers. Let's see, Capricorn, what's going on? Two of Cups. Heart to heart talk coming in. Mr. Romeo, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. And moving on, Gemini, the Aquarius here. Moving to smoother waters. Let's see, Capricorn, what's coming in. For July the 3rd through the 10th. All right, this is y'all weekly. Ah, Empress Energy, baby. What? Somebody got some abundance coming in. Somebody is sitting there attracting, not chasing. Empress Energy, baby. They know what they got. They know they self work. They got some bright ideas coming into fruition. Things about to take off. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Y'all got a lot of Cupid's arrows. A lot of love interests. Ooh, y'all manifestations on fleet. Y'all could be planning a trip, a future, a short trip overseas. Hot mama summer coming up in there, baby. With that uh, three of wands. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Y'all going after something. Aquarius, Taurus, Captain, no, go in and put them in the room. Fill some more. Those two can go in the room. And then fill some more. And the little ones is going to be. I'm not putting this shit in there. Uh, I just put it right there by the door. I didn't say put that in there. I said I'm going to put some stuff in there. Just put it right there. So again, Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo. What? Cap ooh, get, get her little butt out of there. All right. Close the door. Close the door. They're going to push it open. All right. Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo. Somebody want to build with y'all. Capricorn, Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo. Three of Pentacles, Three of Cups. Y'all planning a future. Planning a small trip. Manifesting. Uh, Taurus, put it on the water. Put it on the water. Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo. Uh, again, Five of Pentacles. Right there. I'll get it later. Uh, Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, Five of Pentacles. Somebody want to come out of the cold. Somebody could be doing some type of reading on y'all. Spiritual mother. Uh, again, Earth mother coming in. Somebody stepping in, follow their intuition, trusting their intuition, their spirit guides. Oh, spirit said that was the truth. Ooh, somebody got a decision to make. Somebody gaining some clarity about what to cut out. Oh, that I don't like that Five of Pentacles in the, in the energy unless y'all coming out of that energy. Uh, somebody's out in the cold. Somebody feeling... Uh, victimhood poor poverty mindset uh somebody is definitely maybe y'all leaving okay and y'all left this person out in the cold y'all got some uh clarity on that confusion could be a job don't have to be could be y'all just coming out of that low self-esteem energy uh attracting not chasing queen of my, queen of wands there aries little sagittarius ten of wands somebody wanted y'all burning somebody your boss person or somebody at work could have been burdening y'all down did a car flip over? Like I saw one. No, I guess not. I thought it did. Maybe it flipped it. Flipped back over. Yep, there's Tars Capricorn Virgo. A promotion, a raise, uh, engagement, some events y'all could be going to. Spirit Source Energy, what else? Well, there it is right there. I knew I, put, I saw another one. Page of Wands, Aries, Neil, Sagittarius. Somebody being sneaky. Somebody is definitely traveling towards y'all. Somebody could be lying and cheating. Yep, yep. Somebody definitely doing some type of magic, trying to, to steal y'all ideas, okay? Somebody want to see y'all put out in the cold. Uh, again, Queen of Sword, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. And y'all got the Queen of Sword on the Empress. So this is some jealousy here. This is somebody, yep. Look at that. Y'all getting y'all getting wish fulfillment. Bam, look at there. Somebody hiding. Look at there. Y'all are divinely guided and protected. Y'all finished the race. Y'all still looking good no matter what y'all go through. 
uh, for some of y'all, Capricorn, what is this? Yep, look at there. Nothing but love, baby. Judgment is coming. Somebody's calling judgment. Somebody's going to call y'all out of the blue. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, Taurus, and Taurus. This is spirit saying, yep, this is the one. Somebody's definitely in a new cycle. Could be finishing up a, a mentor-type program. Wedding, union coming in. Heart-to-heart -heart talk coming in here. Choice and lovers. Somebody, Gemini coming in here. Bam, Taurus, Taurus. Damn. Look at that. After a tower moment, breakup. Happily ever after. Bam, the sunshine comes out with a soulmate. Woo! Oh, baby, and y'all cut that person out. Jim and I leave Aquarius. Woo, we stand your ground, don't back down. Bam, again, stand your ground, don't back down. Empress and the Emperor, baby, and the Seven of Wands, both under the deck. Somebody can be seeing 77. There's a seven right there, seven of sword, and then two seven of wands. Y'all got the truth here, though. Clarity, y'all know what y'all doing, y'all know what's going on. What else? Yep, Leo. Queen of Cups could be a mother figure getting the courage to go talk to a mother figure or getting the courage to stay balanced. Maybe y'all are mother. Uh, some of y'all could be dealing with a Leo, getting your courage, your strength, your confidence after coming out of the cold. After this thief, uh, again, somebody could be stealing y'all ideas, doing some type of magic, trying to block y'all from moving forward. But y'all gain some clarity. Y'all go after y'all uh, wishes and dreams. All right, let's see. Eight of Wands, clear five by the four swords, doing some healing work. Magician card, the moon, somebody doing some moon magic. Somebody's using the moon cycles to manifest something. Four sword coming out of that three of a sword energy, the heartbreak energy, fear, rejection energy, queen of wands. Oh, oh, this is a power couple. This is a husband and a wife, or this is somebody that was in a relationship. They is deaf or in some type of business or partnership. So queen of wands and the king of wands. Ooh, Lord have mercy. What is this three of wands? Y'all could be moving. Yep, taking that leap of faith. What is this five of pinnacle? Yep, Jupiter Sagittarius coming out. Somebody's got, definitely could be looking into y'all uh, destiny. Could be a Cancer, could be Aquarius, could be a Sagittarius, somebody, a double Aquarius. Somebody definitely trying to take uh, control of, take, you know which one of those you want to throw away? You know which one of those you want to throw away and keep? Huh? Y'all finna go? Yeah. <laughs> I don't think so. They heard the key. I don't know what she gonna do. Y'all finna go? Yeah. That was quick. Oh Lord. Okay. Ace of Swords. Gemini Leave Aquarius. Hangman. It's time to cut something out. Somebody got some clarity, change in perspective. Turning something around. Look at there. Oh, yeah. Somebody regretting it now, baby. Somebody regretting it. Somebody coming towards y'all. Somebody got some sleepless nights. Some, uh, again, anxiety, depression. Oh, oh, double Empress energy. Whoa. Dang, Capricorn. Somebody trying to steal somebody Empress ideas, baby. Somebody's trying to falsify something. Pretending to be an Empress energy right here. Taurus, Venus. And a seven of sword. Okay, Jim and I leave a Chris. Now somebody's regretting it. Uh-oh. Somebody's about to find out something. Somebody got some anxiety coming in there. Nine of cups. What is it? Capricorn showing up for their own. This could be y'all boss. It could be y'all boss business work or career. And y'all getting y'all wish fulfillment here. And it could be some obsession here. Y'all need to see. Who did I just do? Taurus? Who did I just do? I just did... Oh, I did Earth signs on my Patreon account, and it's sim it kind of similar similar to some of this right here. So if y'all on my Patreon account, go look at that because it's a different reading, but it's kind of the same thing here uh, for YouTube, y'all, if y'all on my Patreon account. So this is somebody obsessing over y'all wish fulfillment, y'all getting everything that y'all want. Somebody could be trying to steal from y'all at work, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, Capricorn, look at that. Aries, Neil, Sagittarius, somebody in their head. Yes, they are free and freedom. Yep, trying to figure if y'all know. Look at there. Y'all be dealing with a, a Libra, a court issue here. Remember, we saw the Eight of Swords. So somebody could have been stealing something from somebody at work. Stealing their work or stealing something from work. Now karma's coming in uh, with that Libra card. Libra, Venus, and uh, Empress Venus out twice. So spirit is definitely stressing. Somebody did something. Y'all stay balanced. Somebody could have been trying to throw y'all off balance. Again, break up y'all home and family. Uh, okay, four of wands, 11, 11. Again, look at there. Somebody left somebody waiting. Pisces, thank y'all. Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio uh, with the uh, Sagittarius energy. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, and the Four of Cups, Pisces. Somebody definitely using their intuition. Yeah, following their intuition. Yeah, look at there. Ace of Cups, seven, six, was it? Six of Pentacles, and 
the uh, Knight of Cups, Spirit Source Energy, what's going on? Y'all got some karmics in here. Y'all could have blocked somebody. Yep, using y'all intuition. Somebody definitely is following their and trusting their spirit guides here. Somebody got a spiritual mother, earth mother, spiritual mother. Yep, dropping that load, dropping them concerns. Look at there. Somebody definitely jealous of y'all. Bam, your glow up season is here. Yep, Gemini, even Chris, somebody from y'all past, King of Wands, already out right there. Wow. Whoa, 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 whoa. Let's see what else going on here. What the bejeebus? There's that sudden wealth, and there's that journey. Somebody going to be going on something. Jackpot. Somebody about to win something. Somebody doing some type of moon magic. There's the lover card. There's a journey. Y'all may meet a soulmate person uh, on a journey, on a trip. Somebody is in their head because y'all moving on without them. All right. Look at there. Lover. Gemini. What else? Yep, thief. There it is. Seven of swords. Somebody don't can't tell me nobody ain't stealing right there. Gemini Leave Aquarius. There it is. Yep. Toil and labor. Somebody could be stealing y'all work. Okay. Trying to uh got low self-esteem. Could be out of work with that five of pentacles. Look at their official. Somebody's getting an official letter of some sort. Somebody's in that uh despair energy. Yep, look at their wealthy man and the coffin. Somebody, look at their despair. Somebody is lonely, despair. Look at their over a wedding. Somebody must have got married here. Y'all are single here with the nine of pentacles, married material Capricorn. Again, uh, somebody could be obsessing over y'all, uh, attracted to y'all, uh, y'all beauty, y'all whatever y'all got going on. Somebody could be trying to uh, fake like they were y'all. Uh, again, there's this wealthy man and there's an ending here. There's a marriage here. They, maybe this person was who lied, said they wasn't married, and they was. Look at them cards flipping out. Yeah, look at there. Concern. Concern. Let's see. Occupation. Definitely have to do with work with Capricorn, work, business, and career. Yep, main man right there. And high honor right here. So somebody's about to marry somebody that got a high honor. Uh, somebody that's uh, high honor. And look, jail time. You can't even make this up. Somebody could have stole from work, stole something to deal, and their boss got caught or they got caught. Capricorn is work, business, and career or toxicity, bad habits, drug addictions. Uh, somebody could have been locked up, okay, because they did something that one of their bad habits probably. Sex addiction, drug addiction, porn addiction, uh, again, codependency issues. With this jail card, Ada, Ada Swart, we saw it already at the very beginning here. So somebody definitely... Uh, could be in a, a jail or going to jail okay somebody could be who knows deck number two let's see what's going on this karmic energy youtube what is going on karmaville choose wisely yep somebody's definitely in the uh, bisexual community craving y'all see i felt like they was obsessing over y'all down here Capricorn, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio with this nine of pinnacle right here. So again, yeah, somebody was. Look at there. Stalking and spying. Didn't I say it? Didn't I say it? Oh my God. They, yeah, look at there. Stalking and spying obsessively. That's crazy. Somebody is definitely, look at there. Somebody demonized. Oh Lord. Okay. Somebody got some uh, sexual demons. Okay. Somebody is definitely uh, abusing their sexual energy. Yeah, I'm crazy over you, tracking you. So somebody is stalking y'all. You will have peace of mind. So some of you probably was worried about that anxiety, about that move, about that trip, about that travel. Somebody like the 6 9 position. Uh-huh. All right, let's see. Somebody freaky, somebody naughty, naughty by nature. All right, naughty by nature. High priestess coming in. Yep, somebody clarifying the high priestess. You raggedy bitch. Okay. Somebody said that they karmic is a raggedy bitch. All right. Y'all think your karmic is a raggedy bitch or y'all karmic think y'all are a raggedy bitch high priestess, which y'all, we know that's not true if y'all are real high priestess. So y'all dealing with some uh, karmic energy here, baby mama drama, hot mama summer with the queen of wands. Somebody, look at that. Didn't I say still somebody was impostering y'all earlier? I told y'all somebody was stealing y'all ideas or thinking they could be y'all, thinking they could get away with it, and now it's come back to haunt them. Now they're obsessing over it, okay, again, because they was trying to portray y'all at work or portray, follow y'all in some type of line of work, business, or career to steal y'all identity. They made a, a fake profile. What the shit backfired? Karmic spell backfires. Baby, that's why they a raggedy bitch. All right, what else, spirit? Oh, baby. Wow. Psychopaths, these fake 
these false empresses, emperors are soulless. So that's who was, <laughs> that's what, who was, <laughs> wait a minute. <laughs> that's who was impersonating y'all. These soulless people made, these, these karmic man, <laughs> raggedy bitches. <laughs> And they spell backfire, y'all. They spell backfire. Yo, my gosh. Y'all, they thought they can look at their semen demon. What did I tell y'all? See, bisexual craving you, egotistical, egocentric. Somebody, look, using manipulation, confusions, betrayal, lies, and cheating. Dark night. Somebody about to go through the dark night of the soul. And bam, there's the empress out three times. So the high priestess was out. The empress was out. So this is somebody definitely obsessing over the empress. Soul ties. Somebody dealing with some sexual, physical, mental, emotional, and spiritual soul ties here as well. That y'all may need to break. Girl, you better not be eating nothing. Where you at? What you doing? Stop. Stop eating off the floor. Yeah, somebody definitely need to take a mental health day. Uh, Capricorn, mental health. Give yourself some self-love, self-care, self-empower, self-development uh, uh, self right there. And then somebody definitely is spying on y'all. Somebody is obsessively watching y'all. Uh, again, ooh, stalking. Somebody stalking y'all. Baby, that's crazy because y'all glow up. Y'all glow up season. Y'all looking good, feeling good, smelling good, doing good. Could be a boss, could be some old man, all right, old woman, uh, somebody in that uh, that likes the opposite sex or the same sex category. Uh, somebody definitely in jail. Ooh, hey, look at that, five of swords. Somebody was jealous of y'all. Could have been Gemini, we could be to the West, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, yep. Moon magic, yep, they watching. <laughs> they was watching, somebody want to see y'all out in the cold. Yep. Somebody don't want to see y'all plans go through. Spirit, look at that. Spirit said, yeah, that was all the truth. Gemini even prayers. Yep. All right. That's it, Capricorn. Peace, love, and harmony. See y'all next week. This is yours for July the 3rd through the 10th. Peace.